YouTube family. Unfortunately, I got breaking news to release to you guys today. PNB Rock reportedly shot dead at Roscoe's. They said condition is unknown, but we do know. Looking at these images and pictures at the Waffle House or the Wa Roscoe's, because first they said Waffle House, but it's at the Roscoe's. It was a robbery attempt and it went brazy. I'm not gonna play the video for you guys out of respect for the family, but you can see him laid up on the ground. If you watch that video, I it behooves you, behooves you to pay attention and not get emotional because you're gonna see something that lets you know confirmation is in. The young man is gone and it's unfortunate. It's unfortunate. Now his girl posted this. Ladies, just like Seti Nash said in his live, I agree with him. Stop posting where you're eating at. I gotta get on my wife all the time to tell her, look lady, we have scoundrels and jack boys out here with no life, ain't worth a dollar, that want to take everything from folks minding their own business. I call them the soul snatchers. And when you taking these images and putting it out there, this is what happened. Now, we're going to read on some of the things and go in on it and look at it. Now, people are saying a whole lot that just went wham, bam. Now, what happened was this afternoon, September 12, TMZ reported that PNB Rock had been shot at Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles restaurant in Los Angeles while he was with his girlfriend. The restaurant, specifically located in Inglewood, according to TMZ, was targeted by a robber who ended up allegedly shooting Rock. Further details on his status are currently unclear. My personal opinion, it looked like he was popped in the face or something like that. You feel me? I'm going to rewind some of it. You know, I'm going to let Seti Naz say this so y'all can hear the audio. This my man's right here. This him right here. I ain't going to show y'all the whole thing. Shout out to Seti Naz. Looking at that image in that video, it was heartbreaking because his head is turned all the way the other way. Me just being a military member, I kind of know I'm gonna fall back from saying what I'm gonna say because it's emotional time right now. I mean, PNB was shot during this attempted robbery, and it, it's a lot of things that's uncomfortable. Graphic video of the aftermath has been surfacing on social media. All hip hop has chosen not to share the video due to the disturbing nature of the footage, and I applaud them for that. I applaud anybody, especially my dog Seti Nash or anybody else who don't show the video you guys can go watch it on the reddit and all that i don't want to watch it it's a lot going on and it's too much you feel what i'm saying man it's a lot man hold on i got it man it's, it's a lot of people who's calling my phone right now it's a lot of people are telling me certain things that happen a lot of people are blaming the girlfriend for dropping his location but the video showed a pool of blood um statuated rumors claim pnb rock was dead while others suggested he was in critical condition but i'm hearing he's 100 percent dead but i'm gonna go pray and hope it's just only critical condition now we're losing too many people in these los angeles street you understand me we're losing so much people and i, I understand the situation of the the, the process you, you don't want to you know, um, you, you don't want to basically put the wrong information while people are mourning right now. It's a lot of sadness going on in the air. And it's like, damn, Quando Rondo just lost a homie. The situation with the Sauce Walker situation. I mean, Jesus, man. It's, it's, it's like the most people you should be fearing is people who look like you. I didn't even hear them tell me the race of the perp, but I can tell you now the suspect is 100% black. I love my folks, but this is like heartbreaking, man. We got to do better. To have a name in the black community today is a death sentence. Someone always have an excuse for these type of people. They say it's the written rules of the street. The streets ain't shit. The street has no compassion the streets have no respect for their own rules so pnb rock i don't know why he moved and rolled around the way he did in that inglewood area knowing he has a name and knowing he gets in tune with other things i did remember when he was in california for the rolling rock festivals i remember when pnb rock 
got into it with that one rap dude trap god or something like that his name that dude who used to be a star back in 2000 and i'll say 10 9 2009 something b you guys know who i'm talking about well they got in a fight with them i remember that and it was a big commotion over there i don't know if it's get back i'm not saying that niggas are hungry to rob you so it's honestly could be anybody it's in the hood I'm not gonna shit on California. It don't matter if PNB Rock was in Cali, New York, Florida, Atlanta, Texas. It don't matter. It's gonna happen where they're hungry at and these niggas have no compassion and they don't give a damn. It is going to happen. It's almost automatically. Now, my heart goes out with the family and friends of PNB Rock. It's heartbreaking to hear the girlfriend crying like that. But my thing to you, mama, why did you post? post the pictures of the food nobody needs to see all that we have to learn to sometime enjoy the moment stop living in a process in time where things are irrelevant you're taking pictures every moment and you're taking a picture of what type of food you're eating boom don't you know these wolves know where you guys are at if they can try to hurt people like me and every regular day people imagine what they're gonna do to somebody with a name especially you got that chain on you got money on your pocket you got money everywhere that you're flashy these wolves are coming like it ain't nothing you hear me they're coming in a fast beat heartbeat at the tick tock tick tock tickety boom and the booming is unfortunate because the boom is a superstar at least in the world of his friends and family even if you don't appear and see it that way but he is a star he is somebody who has work to get and dig himself out of the trenches and become somebody out here he doesn't have to be in the streets robbing and stealing whether you think he's a thug or not or he's a good dude or not i'd rather have people in the community who are getting their chickens in bags so me and my family don't have to worry about you guys doing something to us i thought when people were eating everything could be peaceful but no you got wolves out here it's been like that since the beginning of time you gotta know how to move these are some of the reasons why guys like Quando rondo dropped his flag i think it hit him hard when he realized all the rules he's been fighting for he's been you know damn near sacrificing his life for he realized the rules to the streets ain't no rules this woman is the woman of the street is married to nobody niggas be telling me every day i'm married to the streets no you're not that lady can't even get divorces because she don't wear no ring she has no loyalty to none of you she's friend to none of you the streets is for everybody to eat and nobody to be cool and safe in there ain't no rules leave the streets alone ladies and gentlemen but unfortunately you can go anywhere and it's gonna be what it is man this thing is rapidly going fast and fast as the youngs do not care about life anymore life seems to be something that's just a game on on a gta screen and it's sad it's unfortunate we live in a world today where clout chasing and getting your name and destroying somebody's life is more important look i'm dj bless one thank you for watching another episode of i smoke hip-hop live help our platform by clicking on that like button notification bell like comment share and subscribe my heart goes out to the family look like we say in all our videos man love your family love your kids and stay blessed